Hi, welcome to Framing Tarot. This is going to be the general collective reading for today, July 8th, just whenever you were guided to watch this reading. We're just going to jump right into it. I've actually been sitting here pulling a few spreads already this morning, um, and uh, the energy that's coming through is just uh, kind of crazy. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see what comes out though. Messages for today, please, Spirit. What do we need to be aware of? What do we need to be aware of, please? Messages from my collective. Let's see. That's good. That's good. Hammock. Taking a vacation, either physically or mentally. All right. So some of you guys will be taking a vacation soon. All right. Sometimes this is just going out in your backyard and chilling in your hammock, right? All right. Got Mountain Road. You are on the road to success. So maybe you've been working really hard. It's time to take a vacation, time to chill, time to relax. There's that firecracker card that tried coming out yesterday in the reading. I believe it was yesterday, the one that didn't record. Yeah. So here's this firecracker. Excitement. You are on the road to success, taking a vacation. Hmm. Some of you guys are going on a vacation. Ooh, tulip. Great passion. I believe this came out yesterday in the second reading that actually recorded. Great passion. So there's excitement. There's great passion. You are on the road to success. Something that you're doing here, whether it's love or business, I'm feeling business, but um, it's about to pay off and it's going to be exciting here. It's something that you have poured a lot of passion into, something that you're very passionate about. Maybe you're uh, maybe you guys, some of you guys have uh, launched your own businesses or whatnot, and that shit's going to pay off, right? It's something that you're very passionate about. <clears throat> Excitement and passion. That's like the ace of wands together. It's very, <laughs> yeah, something that you're very, um, this is just exciting and passion. It's just, I can't, I don't know. Oh, it's beautiful though. Excitement, great passion. So this could have to, this could very well have to do in matters of the heart. Right? Let's see how our message is for today, please, Spirit. Could be done with the fire sign with that firecracker. Got the Ascension card. All right, this card, I pulled several spreads yesterday. And this card just kept coming out. All right, so this is absolutely an Ascension. Someone is going through their spiritual awakening, a spiritual awakening. Perhaps you've been on this spiritual path for a while. Um, maybe you guys are, you know... Um, uh, maybe you guys own some kind of spiritual business, right? Either way, we have an awakening here. Excitement and great passion. You are on the road to success. So you are um, ascending here in life and spiritually. On the road to success. You've got magnetic unexplainable pull can't resist Ooh, some of you guys may have some excitement coming in here unexplainable pull can't resist hmm. let's get one more from this deck messages for oh. single current status available yeah so you guys are just single right on your journey here that's what I feel like. I feel like a lot of you guys are just more focused on self, your business, your money, um, your spirituality here. Absolutely. But excitement and great passion, single, out there living your best lives, maybe going to go take a vacation. Maybe you're going to run into a little firecracker on your vacation and have some little fun. I don't know. <laughs> Got TikTok on the bottom of the deck. Deadline time running out. This was showing face in a, in a reading that I pulled earlier this morning. I believe it came out in one of my readings yesterday, too. That card's been showing up a lot. TikTok. TikTok. Tick, 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 boom. <laughs> 
All right, messages for today, please, Spirit. Deadline, time running out. Mm. Stuck. Mm. Stuck. Someone's been stuck for a while, too. Look at that truck. It's all rusted out and, yeah. Stuck. Someone's been stuck, whether it's been you or your person here. Someone may be, have been be stuck in a situation and they know that they need to be single. Maybe this is your situation. Is Maybe this is your energy as well, where you're feeling stuck and you know you need to get out of a situation. I think that was one of the cards yesterday. It's time to get out of a situation. Become single. But I, some of you guys may be in a stuck place. Just, I don't think so. You are on the road to success. So your person, I feel like, is stuck because that truck ain't been moving for a while, but you are on the road to success, right? So your chariot's moving. Someone knows their time's running out here. TikTok on you, Divine Feminine. So, hmm. Obsession must have. Okay, so I pulled several spreads this morning and... There is absolutely somebody obsessed with you. This person cannot quit watching you. Um, mm. Let's see. Let's get some more. Devotion. Conclusion. Divine Feminine. Ooh. Some of you guys are done staying stuck in a situation here. And you're putting it into some shit and walking away. Hmm, maybe you got it. something new and exciting here. Someone becoming single, or is single, has just become single. Hmm, messages for today, please, Spirit. Thank you. Victim, victim, <laughs> victim mentality, staying stuck, staying, yeah, so this is self, self-sacrifice. This is victim mentality. So this is either your energy staying stuck and stagnant or your person. Now, I feel like you are definitely in the road to success in some area. We've got barrier on the bottom of the deck and then self-worth. All right. Mirroring, understanding, and karmic. So barrier, 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 the stuck energy. Barrier. There's been some kind of a barrier either for you or between you and your person here. We got self worth. So, something in, in regards to self worth, staying stuck and stagnant in situations that don't serve our highest good, right? Mirroring and then understanding karmic partners. Some of you guys are maybe um, you're beginning to realize you're dealing with the karmic, or your person may be beginning to understand that they're dealing with a karmic. So, we'll just have to see here. We'll see. Yeah. If your person went and um, like married or proposed, moved in with somebody else here, there's this regrets for making that offer to this person. Maybe you regret accepting this person's offer of marriage and shit just didn't work out. We'll see what's going on here. We'll see. can't remember if I did a full shuffle on my cards or not. So we're going to do a full shuffle. Let's get three more shuffles, please. One more. Oh. Maybe someone's been stuck. There's a mountain here. So uh, mountains represent to me an obstacle of sorts. So perhaps there's been some kind of obstacle. There's this barrier. There's a stuck victim mentality energy. We got the hermit. So I feel like, yeah, this is becoming aware. It just made me think of like a guru, uh, like a guru or, or something like a uh, lives like alone up in the mountains, right? And you go up to the mountain and seek advice from them. <laughs> That's funny. But this is, this is awareness. This is a single them. This is somebody who's absolutely being guided on the path, right? Because the hermit is alone, but aware, aware. All right, so we'll see her. We got the Queen of Cups. The Queen of Cups has been coming out like very, like in every single one of my readings here. So I don't know 
um, what's going on there. Uh, I guess we are still in cancer season. So cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy. But this is, this is somebody who is very much aware, intuitive, you know, enlightened, wise, wise. This is someone who could be going in, searching their emotions. But this is absolutely somebody who um, is very intuitive here. We'll see what clarifies all of this. Um, you are on the road to success. Somebody may be like, you might, guys, some of you guys may be um, in search of love here. We'll see. Got the three of wands near future so look into the future planning your future you are on the road to success taking a vacation so some of you guys may be going on a vacation soon deadline tick tock time running out though time running out no more waiting a decision is uh, being made here a decision is being made let's see got the queen of wands yeah to take action this is a planner, just like I said, planning. There's some sort of uh, planning to take action, needing to take action, taking action. You, this is this firecracker energy, Queen of Wands energy, firecracker, firecracker. Mm. Taking a vacation. So we got two queens here. We'll see how they uh, play together in this reading. Got the four of wands. So this is a, um, uh, financial world or fi financial world, material world, regret, soulmate. So there's two Queens here. Um, and there's all this regret about someone's feeling stuck and stagnant in a, live-in situation Karen. a marriage a live-in situation whatever the fuck it is your person may have ran off and married or another person here got the three of pentacles yeah see there's a third party someone is working together for the money the stability the material world like we saw in this person Either you've been staying stuck and stagnant too damn long and you're having this awakening, this epiphany, this realization that you need to just, focus, you know, maybe you're turning your back on this situation and uh, focusing on the future. Whatever's going on, you, it looks like you probably, you definitely headed towards a bright future. We got three, three here already. Ten of wands, ten of wands, ten of wands. So this, like I said, that mountain obstacles, something's been like an uphill battle here. This is this barrier, barrier, barrier and self-worth. So somebody has a less enough self-worth for staying stuck in a situation that's no longer, that's, that's, was based on the wrong reasons. Cause this was obviously based on material world here. It's based on the money, whatever the fuck here. <laughs> yeah. This person was unawakened. They had big dreams when they got into this union. They had this big, yeah. That's what I, whenever they got into this commitment. Um, mirroring and self-worth. Understanding karmic. Understanding that someone is dealing with a karmic here. And regretting making some kind of offer. TikTok though. Somebody knows, someone, this is a heavy burden here. Um. But this is this barrier here, this barrier tower. Boom. Ooh. Excitement. Absolutely. <laughs> There's going to be some excitement, all right. Oh, okay. This is, someone, this is someone who's like under pressure. Something is under pressure here. Somebody is under a lot of pressure and it's just going to go boom. Yeah. Hmm. Tick tock, tick tock, <laughs> tick tock. It's very interesting because um, all this explosive type of energy here, tick tock. And matter of fact, this was out the other day as well. And some. 
come across and, and it's just weird because i'll wake up the next morning and just jump on youtube and it'll just be like in the feed just that headline like man there's been all kinds of explosions lately there was that explosion out in the middle of the water with the gas line and then i think there was a house that just fucking exploded in detroit there was that car over in where the fuck was it where all them people oh the bomb squad where they were seizing all them firecrackers and the fucking bomb car it exploded somehow and injured all those people it's very just interesting because i'm picking up on all these explosions lately and then i see it all like on youtube the next day uh, it's very it's very interesting how that happens because i don't go searching for it i just post a reading and then i see it <laughs> it's like what the fuck um anyways back to the reading here this is absolutely because uh, this is someone who's bottling as well because this is someone who can be very jealous and very but bottling it right bottling it bottling it playing the victim allowing oneself to stay stuck but bottling mm, until boom tick tock some yeah there's going to be some excitement here all right got the king of pentacles taurus virgo capricorn energy all right so single status available single status available so someone may fear marriage because this is like non-committal um, one may have been and one may not have been. I don't fucking know, but th someone may fear commitment here. This is a loss of stability as well. Absolutely. But this is like the spouse, right? It would be like the spouse. This is like could be a business owner as well. This could be in regards to jobs. Some of you guys, what's the outcome? Eight of swords. Okay, so there's that victim fucking mentality, that stuck energy here. Oh, man. that barrier hmm. nine of cups so here's this excitement though excitement wish fulfillment we got the nine of cups moon ten of cups so all is not as it seems here. Whatever situation this is, all is not as it seems. Someone may be having fears or doubts that they're going to, that you're there happily ever after or some shit like that. But there's absolutely been a rejection. Um, someone... There's absolutely been a rejection and a betrayal and heartbreak here. Some of you guys made... Uh, not, mm. I need to know what this deadline, TikTok, or time running out, whatever the fuck is going on. There's a new beginning here. Some of you guys are... That was another... That was... Uh, some of you guys are will be moving. This is taking this vacation as well right getting this bright idea this is impulsive just doing it here new beginnings though new beginnings headed to somewhere warm headed towards somewhere um happy <laughs> happy 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 new beginnings though with them aces as well all right very interesting let's get the clarifiers this is um this is a very interesting reading Hmm. I feel like you guys are very hard workers. Some of you guys that own your own businesses. This is like boss, business owner type of energy. Um, you are on the road to success, absolutely. Uh, maybe you're fearful to expand because the three of uh, wands is all about expansion and growth and planning the future. The queen of wands is a planner. Plan, you know, takes action. Um, someone... We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. 
Oh, well, all right. Got the queen. I never like it when you get the Queen of Swords with the Queen of Cups together because uh, this is someone who is absolutely single, though, and on their journey, on their path. You get the Queen of Swords with the Hermit. That's very enlightened, very awakened, knows the truth, very wise, very smart, and oftentimes alone. Um, the Queen of Swords has absolutely been hurt very badly here. Um, mm -hmm. So maybe it could be least seeking some kind of legal counsel, but this is truth being uh, uh, shed on a situation. Um, seeking the uh, wise counsel, legal counsel, whatever. But uh, the Queen of Swords also severs ties, becoming single, going off alone. A light's being shed on a situation here. TikTok. TikTok. She's like, uh, hmm. But this is, this is gaining clarity, enlightenment. Um, but victim, stuck, victim. If somebody like ends up in jail or something, got another three here, three of pentacles. So yeah, some of you guys are focused on your work, focused on your business, your money. Like I was saying, you are on the road to success here. Absolutely. You guys may be collaborating with others here. See, like, like I said, talking, uh, this is all like, um, this is like collaborating, conversating, um, one, two, three, one, two, three. There could be three feminines involved here. This could be a lawyer between two women. There's something to do with legalities here as well. There's something to do with legalities. Um, yeah, there's definitely um, third party involvement here, whether it's work or love, but somebody's definitely talking here, collaborating. We'll see. We'll see. Got the queen of wands. Yeah, see, this is like the other woman, right? Yeah. That your person went and built this foundation with. Yeah. Some of you guys are absolutely on the road to success, though. This is absolutely uh, just very successful energy. Um, business owner, boss. Got the seven of pentacles so yeah this is something you definitely put your time and your work your passion your you vested in this business um it is absolutely going to pay off this is also where your person went and invested in this other woman yeah there's some sort of collaboration uh something to do with the future here um having a conversation see someone someone may be seeking legal help out of a situation here TikTok. someone knows their time's running out three of pentacles ten of cups all right so this this could okay so in the spread i pulled before this i was seeing something to do with family and children embarrassed threatened appearances Somebody's afraid of what people are going to think. Family, family, the children. Somebody's embarrassed of like, this could be two different families where like the, they're, what the fuck is going on here? I'm even picking up. I'm telling you, the, the spreads I was pulling this morning were, it's kind of the same type of energy, but this is working together. See, collaborating um within a family dynamic here but it's a completion as well Co the collaborating um uh communications looking so this could be a marriage this could have been just like a lease a mortgage i'm seeing uh, i see every time i see these documents and the queen of swords i think any kind of legal contracts here so this is an actual marriage or these people like invested together here in something like a home, 
major. Got the Ten of Wands with the Fool, though. Someone is dropping a burden. Someone's blocking their own new beginning or something with this barrier self-worth. Barrier and self-worth. We'll see. Tower Death or Four of Swords. Ooh. So whatever this is, this is TikTok. Time running out. An explosion. Oh, man. Oh, man. Hmm. This is like a shocking ending. TikTok. Someone's, um, that's the barrier. Someone is blocking their own new beginning. And it's like TikTok. Like something is going to be for it. Mm, under pressure. Under pressure. King of Pentacles. Knight of Swords. Ooh, stuck cutting. Victim stuck. This could be the police rushing in. Some what the hell is going on here? This is the weirdest energy. There goes that King of Pentacles again. Ooh. This King of Pentacles may end up in jail. Someone may lose their shit here. And end up in jail. This is very unawakened energy. This is someone who's staying stuck and stagnant in a situation because of materialism. Um, staying. St this is someone who's very complacent. Victim mentality. Very victim mentality because of the fucking money. But this person has regrets, but hasn't been making any fucking moves. What the fuck? Five of Wands. Why? Because someone enjoys like the someone enjoys drama. This is great. What the? F so it's like someone in likes. This is drama, and somebody just getting off on the drama they cause. <sighs> Gross. But what the fuck? Someone may have been, you guys, this is a weird fucking energy, but someone might get off on the drama that they're causing between people here. Someone gets off on that shit. But, oh my God. Oh my gosh. I'm telling you. Ascension, the sun, or yeah, Ace of Swords, the sun, Ascension, Spirit Path, Awakening, severing ties. Someone will be severing ties from some shit. Yeah, realizing that they've been playing victim, whether it's you or if your person's dealing with this, but I'm telling you, someone's been playing the fucking victim and they're. Uh, yeah. Th yeah. Victim mentality. Focus on self-love. Like I was saying, some of you guys have been focusing on self-love. Um, oh, man. Yeah, someone... Someone like... Someone's a fucking drama star. Someone just enjoys the drama. That's what I'm seeing here. Someone just enjoys the fucking drama. There's more drama. This is toxic. Whatever this is, it's fucking toxic. Um, it's it's not good. It's very codependent. It's very. egotistical it's like almost like I, I i can't put my finger on it it's like these people somebody doesn't want to leave a situation because it's like um, 
they're worried about what people are going to think or something like that. I don't like this energy, though. I don't like this at all. I do not. Hmm. There's this victim mentality. Someone's staying stuck and stagnant in a fucking situation here. There's that queen. So it could be the queen, right? Staying stuck and stagnant in a situation where they're not even fucking happy here. Remember regretting that offer? Somebody regrets an offer that they either... <laughs> that they either um, made to somebody or that somebody accepted from somebody. Here, and now look. Stuck, like Chuck. That Eight of Wands would be in the reverse. No forward movement. This is weird. It's like someone keeps someone stuck but likes to cause competition. Someone got themselves into some bullshit, and it's all because, man, this is stupid. I'm going to pull another reading probably because this is just fucking dumb. Uh, someone didn't know their fucking worth. Someone didn't know their self-worth. Mm, but somebody may be ascending. I feel like you guys have ascended. You guys are, are single. You've been on the path, I feel like. You're on the road to success. I almost feel like this is whoever the fuck you're dealing with. Because someone got involved in this bullshit here. And it's definitely some third party shit. Uh, this is just complacent victim mentality because codependency gross I feel like y'all should fucking drop this shit I'm leaving something behind someone is someone's collaborating here in regards to the future just <laughs> I see this is very complacent <laughs> This person likes to see this per the Knight of Swords. Hmm. That's what I got, you guys. If you like the video, hit the like button, leave a comment down below, subscribe to my channel, and until next time, love, like, blessings.